our, our goal within the past couple of years, within 2010 and 2011 with Fierce, is to get exposure within our retail base and our grower base, as well as universities, get them exposed to the performance advantages of Fierce versus, uh, and, and what differences that Fierce has versus our competitors in the marketplace today. And, and uh, and what we've learned through, uh, we've had uh, demo trials at the at the retail level, uh, crop destruct trials that we had, as well as university trials, and it's it's really been the first product that that I've been involved with in, in my career that universities have really got behind and actually can have seen such a significant difference that we've got numerous testimonials and uh, and and support from them uh, from some numerous universities and articles that they've had around the weed control that they've seen with Fierce uh, specifically on water hemp and, uh, and, gi and giant ragweed versus our competition. The product's going to be primarily focused toward growers who are, are having a tough time controlling weeds and are desire a higher level of performance than what they're seeing either out of, uh, out of our competitor products as, as, or, or from of our, some of our products that we, are, we already sell today. So uh, typically the products on the marketplace today are providing somewhere around four to six weeks uh, residual control of, uh, of broadleaf weeds and Fierce will be the, really the first product in the marketplace that offers uh, up to eight weeks, even over eight weeks residual control of both grass and broadleaf weeds. And this includes uh, the, the pigweed species such as palmer and water hemp, which is uh, the two key, key, key weeds that growers are uh, having trouble with today. So it's a completely new mode of action uh, for a product called uh, pyroxysulfone, which is a product that we're anticipating being registered in, uh, at the beginning of 2012. And it's, uh, it is a new mode of action. It's, uh, it's a line of chemistry that's similar to what the chlorocetamide family is, but, uh, but it, uh, it, it does affect uh, six different target sites within a plant versus, uh, versus the chlorocetamide kind of chemistry, which is typically, uh, I think, going after about two target sites within a plant.